everybody. We're out here at the Hawthorne Theater, and these are all uh, fans who are here to see a band that apparently they go on whale hunts and whale slaughters. They love it. Then they write songs and perform songs uh, about it, and they are performing here tonight. And they are invited on any time on Jane Unchained to tell their side, but that's my understanding. Sea Shepherd is out here. This is a love demonstration. And uh, there were fans for this band all the way down the block, the side of the building. But there are as many fans, there are dozens of protesters. So um, can you say why you're out here? You're live on Jane Unchained. And why are you out here? There's no excuse for animal abuse. And what do you mean? It's not, if we're allowed to live, so are animals. And right. Yeah. Yeah. That, good All enough. It. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much. Let's see. There's no excuse for animals. Can I just see this sign? Hold on. Can you just slide over? No, no, no. Oh. The sign behind oh, you. Oh, yeah. Really fast. Okay. So this is, this is the idea. Okay. Now, we've got that vegan couple. Hey, Danny. Hi there. Thank you for being out here. The least we can do. The least we can do. And for uh, being a part of this, let's just see what it says. And people can read this. Yeah, I'm I'll take a snapshot now. later. Yeah, so there is, they got a big F off. <laughs> so this is a peaceful love demonstration and the demonstrators are not <laughs> reacting. They're just allowing people to have their responses to Sea Shepherd, and and some of you know that we're going to talk to a Sea Shepherd, uh, the chapter director uh, organizer here in Portland. And uh, as some of you may know, Sea Shepherd is founded and run by Captain Paul Watson. They sail the seas to protect the marine life, particularly marine mammals. So let's have a look and see. Uh, I just want you guys to get a sense, and we're going to come back and talk to Michelle. So. These guys are going in for the concert, and thank you for being out here. And then he offered, can you say what you just offered them and why you're out here? Don't a, go in. Yeah, uh, this sign to tell them not to go in, not to support this cruelty. I gave them a flyer uh, that basically lists what the band is doing, how they're killing. What the what is doing? What the band. The band's tier is doing like the special. The, the band, leads. the music band. Exactly, the lead singer yes, here, who is supporting uh, the killing of innocent whales in the Faroe Islands. Practices illegal in the EU and also in Denmark, but there's an exception for the Faroe Islands for tradition reasons. Yes. And we're here for the whales. We're here, even though it's tradition. Uh, for the individual whale doesn't make a difference. That's why we're here. Gotcha. Okay, thanks. So we're going to hear more about that in a minute from the organizer of Sea Shepherd here in Portland. But as you can see. A great showing tonight, and that vegan couple is in town supporting activists all over the U.S. They're on a U.S. tour, and this drew a lot of folks. Let's see if we can get this sign in without me getting killed. Oh, yeah, we can't right now. Hi there. Hi. Do you want to say why you're out here? Just very briefly, why you're out here and what it's like? I'm out here because the members of this band support the killing of pilot whales on the Faroe Islands. Now they defend this by saying it's a cultural tradition, but yeah. when there are victims to cultural traditions, it's time to change those traditions. This isn't an attack on their culture, this is a defense of these animals that are highly intelligent, beautiful, and endangered creatures, and it's illegal to perform these acts, to herd these creatures into bays, and slaughter them by the hundreds in the European Union, but they still participate in this act in Denmark. And that's Thank wrong. you. Thank you. That was well said. And uh, I just want to show you guys. I see the car. So look at this. Look at this. So defending ocean wildlife worldwide. That's seashepherd.org if you want to know more. Thank you for being out here. And then this is, this is Taji, isn't it? Taji? No. Okay. It's a, well, we'll just, we'll just look at it and you can imagine. This is a ritual it happens in various places in the world the killing and it's for it's always it's exploitation it's always for some benefit to humans but not so much for the animals including marine animals yeah the band these guys yeah no 
This guy right Not here. Not so much. This guy right here is your bassist. And, and just, just In like... In your opinion, what is he doing? What is the problem? Well, this is just like when some of your favorite... Uh, I was saying this to another person earlier. This is just like when Mel Gibson came out with his anti-Semitic bullshit, right? Yes. It's up to that person Keep to it clean not for watch the viewers. that yeah. movie and not support yeah, that yeah. person. So if you like this band, but you don't agree with why he's doing this... Right. Maybe that's... Oh, it should be one of those morally, ethically things you should ask yourself that question, in other words, right? Exactly. If somebody is spewing something, say racist. I don't support Kevin Spacey anymore because of what he did. Okay, right? that's your. See what I mean? Okay, so and I love your shirt. It's Satan, say, Satan worshiper. Yeah, Satan. I should know that as a vegan. Good stuff. Uh, right on. Thank you so much, Matt, yeah. for being out love here you, and Danny. being their voice. Love you. And again, the band, uh, the leader of the band, anybody is rep is invited to represent their side. But this is what we're doing to these animals. This is what is being done for profit. This is why these protesters are out here. They resist, they tear up families. It's, it's illegal in, in the EU, illegal in Denmark. Look at this. Follow the money. Don't always follow the money. Mm -hmm. So. What a special little spot. The Faroe Islands, again, you know, tourism representatives of the Faroe Islands can come on and, uh, and, and point out their side, why they allow it to happen. This is, this is what, you know, we teach children. Yeah, he thinks that's normal. He's happy because they're conditioned. We've all been conditioned. Okay, we're gonna talk to the organizer here. Did he take a flyer? Yeah. <laughs> Most just, people totally avoid eye contact and they just Yeah. You know, they go the fact that people are uncomfortable says there's something wrong here. Right. Say that again? The fact that people are uncomfortable says there's something wrong here. That sounds like a honk of support, I'm just gonna say. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Darla, no excuse for killing. I'm reading some yeah, Sea Shepherd, let's go. Right on. We're, I'm reading some of the comments. There you go. Woo! Portland's getting a lot of support. These uh, protesters are getting a lot of support. And can you say why why you're saying it, they're cowards for this? Only a coward would participate in hurting the families of whales and slaughtering them in front of their families. There's nothing brave or proud about that. These guys are outright cowards. They should be ashamed. Well, I gotta say, I personally agree with you 100%. Thank you for being out here and representing their voice because without their voices, they're not heard. Look at this. This is why they're out here. Okay, let's find Michelle. Hey there. Here's a Sea -shirt Shepherd uh, grassroots member. And uh, thanks for being out here. You know what? I just saw Michelle. I'm gonna go talk to her. Okay, you're on. I wanna know. This is Michelle Seidelman. And thank you so much. Let's just get a little. Hundreds of pilot whales are killed. Look at this beautiful spot, and I bet it's going to change in a, in a little second. It's called the grind. Look at how beautiful it is, and then wait. So there, they, they reel them in. I don't know how, and then look at them. Look what they do. The killing season. Is this an annual thing? I'll, I'll, I'll ask you in a minute. Now watch, the, the, the water's gonna, look at this, look at this. If it's hard to look at, maybe it's not right. It's brutal, oh God. All right, well, it's gonna go into more depth of, of horror. It's like, oh, it's worse than a horror movie because it's real, it's not fake. Can you say, can you tell us? Yeah. It's all you, tell us. Yeah, so basically, we're out here tonight because Tear is the band. Tear is the band. Is the band, and they are they are from the Faroes Islands, and they participate in these grins. And basically, what a grin is. Oh, it's is, a grin. Yeah. Sorry. Um, what they do is they they monitor whether a pod of whales is migrating through the islands, and once they. Um, they, you know, indicate that there is a pod traveling through. They take boats out and they create a wall of sound with banger poles. Oh. And they scare them with a wall of sound into a cove. And 
and um, Sea Shepherds is, is there. We, we have Zodiacs and we try desperately and sometimes with success. We're able to, to sabotage it a little bit? Yeah, we're able to disperse the pod and scare them back out. Yeah, like the duck like the duck activists uh, against all those duck shootings. Yeah. There's tactics. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and um, if we're not successful, um, what happens is as they come into the shore, um, they run out into the water and they use the they use the tool that hooks into their blowhole and they pull them onto the shore. Once they pour them onto the shore, they usually immediately cut a few of them because once they are cut and injured, the other family members will not leave them. They will not abandon them. So they use their love in connection with each other against them. And they um betraying their uh, absolutely. And so basically they're going to wait for their turn because they're not going to abandon each other. And I think that's one of the cruelest um, things that they do is actually use their love and their connection to each other against them. That is and, cruel. Yeah, if, that if they were doing that, hold on. And I just wanted to say, if if they if all this was happening to, to dogs, we'd be all over it. Yeah, absolutely. And these are some of the most sentient beings really out there. Their brains are extremely large. They're very complex. Um, they live in families. They do not separate from one another. And um, they're, I mean, I actually was listening to a story today about uh, 50 of them that had beached and uh, they caught all of them but one whale off the beach and um, three days they went went by while they tried to get this remaining uh, pilot whale off into the ocean. Yes. And when they they actually ended up pulling him out, her out onto jet skis to get over the tide. And when they got there, the overhead shots showed all of the pod had sat out there for three days waiting for that one whale to return back to the family. So That's they're preying on their innocence are. and their yeah, love absolutely. and their so complex family systems. Absolutely. So just to finish, then once they um, have them in with a blowhole, they use a spade to sever their spine from their head. And generally, it, it takes multiple tr multiple impacts in order to actually sever sure, their spine. Sure, because they're massive. Yes. So what is yeah. their, why do they do this? Are they eating the animals? Well, Are they, what's happening? They, there is a small portion of the meat that's consumed. It's more of a delicacy. It's kind of in their gift shops as whale meat. Tourism. You know, when you're there, yep. you know, there are some Follow the timers that eat it. But the majority of the meat is not consumed. And we actually, I don't know if you were able to catch any of the signs I made, but they actually weigh them down and sink them to the bottom of the, of the coves. And um, we pull them up and show, look, here, here, mm. here's number 58, carved and laying here, and now 58 is sunk down to oh. the bottom of the... Where can people uh, see more uh, footage or learn more information? And behind her is the Sea Shepherd flag uh, you flying. SeaShepherd.org. Um, you can go to Sea Shepherd's YouTube. Um, and look up the grid. There's a lot of videos, a lot of information. And it's called the the grid or the grind. It's the grid. It's G R I N D. Okay, good. They actually call, they call it the grind, the grind and hop. Yeah. But everyone else calls it the grind. <laughs> Got it. Well, thank you so much yeah, for thank you, Danny. yeah, yeah thank, thank you for caring about the pilot males. Of course. Um. So again. What's, what's it been like to be out here? How have, people, how have the fans who are waiting to see the band been responding? Because you're here to raise awareness, right? That probably yeah. they don't know. They were like, just being angry, a lot of them saying, you know, just defending their band, the way people defend eating meat. It's the same thing. Sure. But you guys are raising awareness, you're planting yeah. the seeds, they can't turn away. Some of them were nice. One girl went in, she said she bought a ticket, she was going to wash them, but she wasn't going to wash them after that. And you know what, the whole time, all of them see you guys, because there was a long line around the block here earlier, they're all inside. Um, they're going to be thinking about it yeah, while are. the band is they playing. Are. And didn't somebody say they actually have song or songs about yes. this? He sings about. <laughs> does so yeah brags about it and his delightful music so. gotcha all right well thank you so much
thank you. And then, of course, it wouldn't be the same. What's her name? His name, Lou. His name is Lou. Hey, Lou. What's up? He's a pit bull rescue? Yes, from LA shelters. Wow. All the way from, he's a Los Angeles boy? Yeah. Yeah, you can tell. He's got that sort of chillaxing, surfing. <laughs> Look, thank you so much. Thank you. Okay, guys, I'm going to show you a little bit more. turn it on me because I felt like wearing this shirt in the spirit of things Peter rocks I think and for those who haven't seen this is our latest hat Jane Unchained can somebody read out loud what, what it says it says I know what it says but I can't remember now it says Jane Unchained news network videos for the voiceless Woo! Woo! videos for the voiceless so um, we're out here, uh, so yeah, so I just wanna share what it's like to be out here. It's very powerful to be amongst people who really care, now I can see myself, <laughs> uh, who really care and are out here to be their voice because without, without them, they have no one. They're out in the seas and they have no one. Imagine if it were you, you'd want these people to be out here for you too. It's the right thing. And, and you know, they're not trying to make these people wrong. If I were in line for this concert, I would never have known. I probably wouldn't have known. There's so many things before I went vegan that I didn't know. And so, you know, once you know better, you do better. And I think that's the idea is, you know, raising awareness, planting seeds. They're worse, there was some hostility, but that's okay. You know, the low hanging fruit are people who just sort of like, huh, they're thinking about it, and uh, I think that's important. Yeah, oh yeah, thank you, George. Beautiful dog, yes. Okay, everybody, this is Danny Rukin, live with Jane and Shane. We're here in Portland at the Hawthorne Theater, and again, uh, this band, Tear, is welcome and is invited on any time to share their side, but uh, they're in there performing, and they participate in the Faroe Islands, the hunting and the, the killing, it's not a hunt. It's a killing, a slaughtering of these whales. It's tradition. And uh, then they sing and write and play songs about it. You know? It just, um, can you imagine? If these were dogs, we'd be all over it. All right, guys. Uh, yeah, it is god awful, Maureen. I agree with you. Yeah. Okay, everybody. Uh, spread, spread this so that people can learn and know about it. Because I had no idea. It just never seems to end. You know, follow the money. All right. Over and out, everybody. Talk to you later.